Oh. Mm-hmm. oh. This ain't going oh. how you oh. thought it was, huh, oh, Grandma? Wait, this ain't Disney Playboy. I ain't Bambi. Now, hold on, let me yeah. reflect. Hold mm-hmm. on. Yeah. Wait, These antlers made of oak, Playboy. Hold on. Hey, 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 mm-hmm. hey, man, let me get my feet mm-hmm. together, man. Come on. Oh. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You're more, you yep. more formidable mm-hmm. than I anticipate. Let's anticipate getting your ass the hell up out of here. Please subscribe. Do remember, if you wish to open a trading account, check out my Webull link below. You'll get some free stocks. Minimum deposit required is $100. Also, pre-market hours trading starts at 4 a.m. sharp. 4 a.m. sharp with Webull. Webull only the way to go. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the channel. My name is Dave Natch. I speak stocks. Today is Thursday, December the 16th. And in today's video, I have one play for you. One play and one to put on stock. But before I go into the plays, let me delve into yesterday's recap of the markets. The Dow Jones Industrial Average rallied late afternoon yesterday. They closed up 1% at 35,927 after a surprise Fed decision. Go ahead and read the news. This was a 2 p.m. rally. The NASDAQ, they closed up a whopping 2.15% at 15,565. Apple, Apple closed up 2.85% at $179.30. Apple, let's jump right into it. Dave's play today is an MT play called CALT. The stock is up 38% on FDA fast track approval of their drug Tarpeo. Go ahead and read the news on your own time your own term okay this one is used to treat kidney disease go ahead and do your research the stock is up 38 percent thus far at 25.75 the high of day 36.12 this one made a new 52 week low yesterday 14.22 their 52 week low and their 52 week high is 34.75 this one has some room to the upside if this one retracts below 22, 25, this might be a no-go today. Let's kick the tires. Call to where's a market cap of 463 million. They have 16 million in the float, no insiders. 4% of the float are held by institution and short size a measly 0.20% of the float. Their gross profit is 874K, cash and A, debt and A, total debt, per equity 15.64 and their current ratio is 8.97 sparse data on this one this one is in the biotech space called please put a stock on AVCT today the stock is up 13% thus far in the pre at 173 after <laughs> spiking up 25% yesterday AVCT this was Dave's play last Thursday, last Thursday, December the 9th. Go to that video for the numbers. That's all I have, ladies and gentlemen. Do not forget to follow me on Twitter, at WT for my stock alerts. In the meantime, always protect your neck. Always set a stop loss. Do not invest more than you're willing to lose. And when you see some profits, take some profits because now you see it. Now you don't. Dave Natch, I'll see you when I see you. I'm out. Boom, bam. Make your next trade the best trade. Take care of your downside and let your upside take care of itself. I'm up.
Ска. I thank you for watching. Dave Natch, I'm out. Welcome back to the channel, everybody. My name is Dave Natch. I speak stocks. Let's delve right into Dave's play. This is the recap edition. The Dow Jones closed up strong, sturdy, and steady. You could have took your seatbelt off today and relax. No gyration, no fluctuation, no turbulence. The Dow Jones heading up steadily. Uh, they closed up 1.39% today, the Dow. At 27,202, they're back at 27,000, the Dow. New highs looms large for the Dow. Companies coming out with good earnings. I think we might see 30,000 before we see 20,000. The Dow looking very strong, sturdy and steady. All right, the NASDAQ. The NASDAQ printed a new record, a new all-time record at 11,000. <laughs> I can't believe this. 11,000. Unprecedented. I remember when the Dow was just at 11,000. <laughs> the stock, the NASDAQ closed up 0.52% at 10,998. Okay? New record high printed today at 11,000. Let's delve right into Dave's play. Dave's play was Val, V-A-L. The stock didn't make it to 65 cents, so right away that was a scratch. V-A-L, a non, late non-starter today, okay? They closed up at 9% at 43 cents. Stock opened up at 51 cents. High of the day, 52 cents. The low of the day, 41 cents. Today's volume was 24.5 million, okay? Compared to their average of 20 million. So the average is 20 million. Today's volume was 24.5 million. Not much increase in volume. So that one was a no-go, V-A-L. Dave's bonus play, Myos, M-Y-O-S. My older subscribers know, wait 15, 20 minutes before trading, okay? The stock, I told you watch for a pullback towards 150, okay? The stock went as low as 164. So anybody who grabbed in the 164, 160s uh they're making money right now the stock closed at two let me tell you where the stock closed at the stock closed at 184 so if you pick up some at 160s and rode it all the way up to 184 that's about a 16 percent gain pretty decent okay MYOS, they closed up 48% at 184. They opened up at 268 and went as high as 288 and as low as 164. Okay? Today's volume was 80 million compared to 4 million average. All right? Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Please hit that notification. These videos are time sensitive. Okay, please like the video. Let's go ahead towards stocks kicking up rumpus in the AH. We have CBL. CBL is up 75% at 
at 34 cents. I don't see any news, but yesterday they had news. CBL, go ahead and read the news. Sometimes these pennies, they have a delay reaction to news. Okay? Let me repeat. Sometimes these pennies has a delayed reaction to news, okay? So maybe that's what's happening with CBL. All right. Next play is AVCT. They're up 63% in the AH at $7.88. They came out with news. AVCT is going to acquire Ribbons Candy. Ribbons Candy agreed to be acquired by AVCT. Go ahead and read the news. They're up 63% on that news, okay? Another thing I noticed with AVC, AVCT, okay? Nice five-day chart. Stocks that have that staircase, five-day chart. are pounds to pop all right they have a tendency to pop most stocks with that five day steer staircase up 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 that check out the five day chart on our a v c t you see what i'm talking about pay attention to that five day chart that has that steer climb all right they usually pop and not pop down, pop up. Next we have AVXL. AVXL, they're up 30% at 592. I don't think there is any news. Okay. And E-Man, E-M-A-N, I tweeted this one about 355. I saw a late surge with E-Man. All right. Because I, I, I have some shares in uh, since in the 80s or 70s. I'm in and out, in and out. But I, I always leave one share just to watch price action. And I saw the movement. I think I was alerted by Robinhood. Robinhood alerts you every 5% move, okay? Lo and behold, the stock took off right before the bell so i think i bought some more shares they're up 22 percent in the after hours please pay attention to the 2 p.m runners i tweeted this one follow me on twitter at the petite had you bought you would have been up over 20 percent right now all right easy money guys easy money pay attention to these late runners all right i think i tweeted this at 355 and the stock was at $1.13 at the time. Okay? E-Man. Pay attention to this one for tomorrow. Please like the video. Please protect your neck. Please trade well. Alright? Do not trade more than you can afford to lose. And always start with a tester position. MVIS is down 30% in the after hours. MVIS. Okay? That's the reason why I tell you, you never know with these stocks. They're up today, down tomorrow. So take profits while you can. All right, protect that cash, guys. I'll see you in the AM with Dave's Play and Dave's Bonus Play. With Dave's Play, a little goes a long way. Have a good night. Boom, bam! Remember, if you wish to open a Webull account, check my link below. You'll get two free stocks. Thank you for watching.